All the goals came in the second half, ending a gallant challenge from the Wessex League Premier Division Minos. James Hayter scored twice and Alfie Rutherford also found the net. The victory capped off the fine treble for Lee Bradbury's men, after clinching the National League South title and Hampshire Senior Cup. The Hawks controlled the early stages but the first shot of the game came from Port Chester. Simon Stone started the move with a good interception inside his own half. He found Steve Ramsey on the edge of the Hawks area, whose fiercely struck volley was beat away by keeper Ryan Young. Another good move by the Royals ended with Jake Morgan firing over the top. Wessex League Premier Division sides were gaining in confidence and Young had to race off his line to foil Dan Wooden. Charlie Tarbuck went close to breaking the deadlock on 20 minutes with a shot that rebounded off the inside of the far post. Ex-Hawk Ramsey was running the show for Port Chester in midfield with his incisive passing. The Royals were proving more than a match for their opponents who will be playing four divisions higher next season. Twice before the break Alex Baldacchino went within a whisker of putting Port Chester in front. The Hawks made the breakthrough three minutes into the second half after they were out of the traps quickly. A good break down the right ended with Hayter sending a firm header back across goal into the far corner of the net. The Royals refused to be downbeat and kept pushing for an equalizer. It took a last-ditch block from the Hawks to keep out Morgan's goal-bound shot. On 68 minutes, though, the Hawks tightened their grip with a second goal. Rufford latched onto a long ball over the top and easily chipped his shot over the onrushing goalkeeper. A third goal followed in the 71st minute when Hayter notched his second of the game to wrap up the win for Bradbury's troops.